Hey everybody, what's going on? I just added the pelican to rat's nest here and I'm excited to see what's outside of the map. Um, probably some new stuff we haven't seen before, like uh, the other map I just did. Uh, it's been quite a while since I've actually played this map, so... Oh yeah, I remember. Oh yeah, this is, this is amazing. I don't know if it's just me, but my budget is gold. It looks like gold numbers. Uh, so the first thing we should be able to do is go outside of the map uh, without dying. That is the first thing that we did here. Some uh, civilization down there. Uh, there's a pelican over here. I know you can't fly it, but uh, I did indeed add the pelican so that you can fly it around. So, so obviously if you get over here, uh, the pelican, um, you cannot fly the one that's over here. Because uh, you would obviously die if you tried getting over here, but there is no way to fly this pelican uh, whatsoever. Uh, so I'll just place my pelican down over here, probably. And uh, we'll go from there. Is there a rocket here? I don't know why there's a rocket. Uh, <laughs> so the first thing's off. Uh, let's see how far out you can go in the map. Um, the BSP is usually not too big. Uh, see, that's the that's the end, edge of the map there. Can't really go any further. Uh, let's, let's start descending now and see what's beneath us. And that's the bottom right there. So we are enabled to actually explore more outside of the map, but I did put these awesome vehicles in here. Um, hopefully with a great reason. Um, they obviously keep the death barriers pretty compact so that you don't see how small the map really is. And after doing all that multiplayer and matchmaking, you see this pelican over here and you're just like, ah, why can't I fly that thing? It looks so tempting. I also put in the, uh, the chair and uh, a phantom to fly around, so... I don't know where the chair just went. We'll start with that first. Okay, there you are. Should be able to get inside of it. Yeah, okay. So we'll just fly the chair around. Uh, I'll see what's more over here. Uh, can't be like Bungie didn't add that much detail. Uh, looks like there's a little something inside of here. Maybe? No? Not sure. Some pipes, like an underneath platform here. It's kind of neat. I think it's like a hunter blast or something. Maybe a shrunken down scarab <laughs> uh, I can't stop uh, it's this thing's really it's a lot harder to control than it looks believe me it's not uh, it's not very responsive um, I mean the death barriers are removed so I guess we could try a few things uh, I'm not actually sure what's inside there I know you can get inside of here if you use the turret in fact I'll probably just demonstrate that real quick I really enjoy the turret glitch. Did it just fall over? Wow, you dumb turret. I'm actually going to try this on multiple other places where you die, usually. Um, but yeah, obviously, you can go inside of this, no problem. Uh, but another obvious place I'd like to see out of bounds would probably be right here. If I can actually put a turret properly here. Let me do this. I mean, other than flying the pelican, you know, I mean, it's removing death barriers. It's exploring what's outside of maps, right? Dumb turret. I can't, I'm absolutely unable to, like... All right, here, let's try this. Oh, I'm out of turrets. Wonderful. Here, let's see if we can get outside then. Oh, I actually did die. That's because my character is invincible. Let's maneuver back around here. There's a door here. Maybe we'll, we'll try seeing what's outside of there next. I don't know why. Uh, why do you do that? You guys just see that? You guys seriously just see that? It's so dumb. Cannot create an object. Not enough room. So I don't get it. Am I supposed to place the turret like over here? No. No, I just got stuck.
All oh, right, that did it. Um, and just to touch on how I solved that problem, I just simply grabbed a barrier. Uh, so outside of here, nothing really, just a simple, really crammed uh, BSP. I can actually see down there, there's some sort of base. It actually looks like the one on standoff that I just recently showcased. And so something I actually completely forgot to do was fly this phantom around. And I know this map is so small, but, you know, uh, flying something on a small map, I mean, why not? This is a, it's actually, I wonder if I can get to the other window over here. Can I or can I not? Pretty much a wall all around. There's like birds flying around me. By the way, just to get an idea of how small that pelican is... Oh, it just shrinks. Okay. So, it starts off as... Uh, a pretty ideal size model, and then it just shrinks really small. It doesn't actually go far away, it just shrinks to make it look like it's going far away. Alright, well, I can assume that this wall over here is pretty much just the same exact as that other wall back over there. Uh, and over here, I'm not sure if there's much to really go over or check out. Because like I said, I mean, I did remove the death barriers. I think there's actually one... No, there actually isn't one up there. Okay, where is my turret? I don't know where you went. Because that is much easier, and I would much rather go through that struggle. Okay. There you are. Yeah, so, uh, you can obviously see here, if the, if the camera is pretty much propped behind the turret, just like this, that means you'll probably just die, uh, like I did. And really, the reason for that is because the camera doesn't have anywhere to go, so it just gets smushed, um, between the turret and what isn't behind the wall. Okay, so there's a door right here. Uh, I don't know why, I used to think there was like a hot tub behind this door, like some sort of like spa or pool. I don't know, it's kind of weird. Just all that, all those younger memory things. Obviously I did try doing that, yeah, there's ab absolutely nothing behind it. Uh, so I kind of wonder what's behind those doors there. I'm going to see if I can prop something up there. I don't know how I'm going to get a machine gun turret. I don't know where my turrets are. Alright, there's one. There's two. Okay, my budget just turned pink. Why Why? Am, why are the numbers pink now? I didn't actually... I did not actually mod it to do that. I don't... I, like, I'm serious. I, I don't know why it's turning pink. Uh, however, there is one old trick or technique you can do to do this. It's, uh, you simply place the object where you want. It has to be an object that's fixed, i.e. you place it down and it stays put after a while. By the way guys, I completely had no idea what I was doing at this point. I was basically just trying to get through this entire window here and uh, ended up taking a lot more time than I needed so uh, enjoy it anyway. If I save the map, like I'll just do here, with the turret in place, and then I end the game, uh, the game actually thinks that the turret is still up here when I saved the map. And if I start up the map again, uh, the turret should be back where we just placed it. I'm pretty sure I can. <laughs> there it is, after all, the turret, you know. Just sitting there. And we are in. This is actually quite nice. I would actually, so, let me spawn... So, too, wait, too many turrets on map. Uh, I don't know about that. But we are going to see what's behind this door after getting up here. Let's see if it's a positive result. There is actually something behind here. Okay, so that was weird. I ended up dying, yet there was clearly uh, a loose camera. Meaning, there possibly was something back there. Now my turret's gone. Wow, that's so stupid. I didn't check out this. Oh, so that's what's up here. Okay. Like I said, guys, I had completely no idea what I was doing. Huh, I'm actually curious to get back inside of there. See, like, I wonder what's behind that door. Well, let's do this then. Alright, so just so the map doesn't ask for me to, uh, delete a turret, I'll just delete it there. And so we have our turret here. Let's try this out. 
I'm quite anxious to go behind like this door. Pretty sure I know what's behind that door. It's really neat up here. Even though you aren't intended to go inside of this, it's pretty sweet. Alright, so before I actually do this, let's see. Let's let me guess. I'm gonna guess there's nothing behind this door. But there is a reflection there, so I don't know. I'm I'm still gonna guess there's nothing behind it. Yeah, there's nothing. I died. Well, guys, I'm pretty sure we looked over everything on the map. No, I mean, not absolutely everything, but you know what I mean. Just enough to pretty much satisfy flying this pelican around. I mean, concluded that the, the map is indeed small. It's not, it's not intended to fly a pelican on, but it's this pelican here that just always gets that inspiration going. So I thought I would do that. On behalf of a pelican, you know, we got our rockets here. I, you know, that's an undying thing. I, I absolutely love that. Um, but yeah, if there's any any questions you guys have, um, be sure to comment, leave a like, or subscribe. I will be sure to answer them. And, um, yeah. So I'll probably have another video out like this. Or if I don't, probably another campaign video or something. And uh, I will see you. I will see you then. <laughs>